Amazon Nenen, Amazon Nahai, Ahanoston Net. The power of the enemy is growing. Sauron will use his puppet Saruman to destroy the people of Rohan. But to hell, see! Isengard has been unleashed. First light on the fifth day. At dawn, look to the east. For a wizard is never late, nor is he early. Gandalf. He arrives precisely when he means to. better way to start off a game than that. Gandalf! Welcome back! Take a few of these, game. if you don't mind! Swiftly attack these or okay! So welcome everybody to the return He's of the game. A demon. Head back! The new Gandalf has quite a temper! Very used to playing this on console. Use uh, fierce so attacks upon their shields. The, uh... PC version is quite new to me. So you must excuse me if I get my ass kicked a little. Now, I did try to emulate this, but uh, the performance was very poor. Now, one thing you'll notice right away is that uh, it's a lot harder to get a perfect meter built up in this than it is in two towers. Trying to get a fair number of kills because it'll give me experience which I can use for, you know, my stuff. I stabbed him right in the dick, or at least if he had a dick. If Uruks have dicks, I stabbed him in it. That's my jump back, alright. I customized my controls, that's why I know what I'm doing. But this is my first time actually playing with those controls. The cool thing about this mission is you can basically just fight here as long as you want. Of course, limited by the amount of health that you have. Speaking of health, thank you. Leave my row here below! Oh wow, he got smoked. Another nice thing about this game is you can attack shielded enemies from behind with weak attacks. 
you don't automatically have to do the fierce attack. Although it is generally safer because the aiming can be a little wonky. Ah! <laughs> the, the, the nice thing about this game, you can hit enemies while they're in mid-air. Yeah, I think I'm going to be stuck with a good rating on this level. I just don't have the ability to build up any combos. Ow. Any more? I'm not sure if there's a limit to them. Some levels, depending on how many you kill. Yeah, I think I've killed them all. You generally want to try and do that to get as much of uh, much of your experience as you can. I'm here, Legolas! Gather your power and unleash it. Knock their arrows aside. Fin their red... You can absolutely wait. Hurry, Gandalf! Oh, my God! Tricky. Spear some motherfuckers. Try firing that. Use the spears. Yeah, I'd definitely taking more hits than I would be if I was on console, but uh, the controller support for this game is terrible. Like, really bad. Another. Smoke them. Yeah. Look at the size of their swords. Jesus Christ. I uh, ran out of enemies to hit. The field is ours. We'll see about that, assholes. We must flee. I also like how w Gandalf is just like throwing javelins at people. Like, wizardry be damned. Let's just spear a motherfucker. I also like how you knock their helmets off. It's pretty funny. If you look at them, they, this spear is right through them.
Definitely getting a lot of pretty good excellent kills. And there it goes. That part's on a timer, so. All you can do is get as much experience as you can. Return to your master! Creatures of shadow! You know, I never realized, but that's kind of an asshole thing to say in the presence of the king and Aemer. It's like, you just fought and lost hundreds of your men, and it meant nothing. Like, have some tact, Gandalf. Jesus Christ. Now we got a pretty good bunch of excellent kills there. No perfects, though. Gonna have to come back to perfect this mission. It's just not in the cards. Without combos to give you bonuses. Alright, so. Uh, we want. All. Uh, let's see here. Let's go up. Orc Bane. Strength of Stone. Orc Hero. Yes, please. Uh, final judgment. I feel like Orc Bane might be better than that. Alright, well, we've only hit level 3. See, even through purchasing it there, I don't have access to it until I level up the heroes there that are using it. But I guess we'll go with um, Orc Bane. And then we can go with just a Gandalf upgrade here, maybe. Nope. That's all we can do. Alright, continue. Mouse controls are a little wonky in this game. Okay. The Eye of Sauron now turns to Gondor, the last free kingdom of men. His war on this country will come swiftly. He senses the ring will draw close, and the strength of the ring bearer will fail. In the end, this war must be decided by the smallest of things. For the ring wanted to be found. My task began when I beheld it upon the floor of Bag End. Then I realized how cleverly it returned to the world of men. Riddles in the dark, my precious. Still questions needed answering. Secrets only Minas Tirith, ancient city of men, could reveal. The year 3434 of the Second Age. Here follows the account of Isildur, High King of Gondor and the finding of the Ring of Power. It has come to me, the One Ring. It shall be an heirloom of my kingdom. All those who follow in my bloodline shall be bound to its fate, for I will risk no hurt to the Ring. Nice going, idiot. It is precious to me. Precious. It was in this moment that all that must be done became terribly clear to me. I would weave a plan for a great war, yet count upon others as agents of our fate. It was the destiny of Aragorn, heir to the throne, to lead this war. I foresaw warriors of every race fighting as companions alongside him. Together we would spring a great trap before the walls of Minas Tirith. But in truth, our war is but a diversion. 
For to destroy Sauron utterly, the ring must be taken to Mount Doom. And for this, our fate would lie in the hands of two small hobbits. For they, like us, will be in great peril. Alright. This episode's almost certainly gonna get flagged for copyright, but I don't care. <clears throat> we'll start things off with the nice cinematics. Uh, but clearly, you know, massively, blatantly, probably copyrighted cinematics, I'm gonna be cutting out of future ones, so. Alright. So we can continue on and choose the path of the king, uh, the path of the wizard, oh. or the path of the hobbits. So I think I'm gonna stick with the path of the the, uh, the path of the wizard. Let's go and kick some ass in Isengard. <laughs> That's another great thing about this game is the variety you can play is like all these different characters once you get everything unlocked. It was not mere chance that brought Merry and Pippin to Fangorn Forest. Run, Merry! He's talking, Merry. The tree is talking. Tree? I am no tree. I am an ant. The ants have not troubled about the wars of men and wizards for a very long time. gets me hyped even after all these years. And now the event set in motion at Helm's Deep will be concluded. Isengard must be cleansed. Yes, it must. And in the shade of Fangorn's trees, Saruman's Uruk-hai shall find no refuge. Kill them all. Filthy scum! Smoke rises from Isengard. The hour grows late. And now you strive to place God, seeking my, my counsel. But that is why you have come, is it not, my friend? That's what I'm talking about. Hasten to Isengard! I shall deal with these! Out of my way. I'm gonna die. I died. <laughs> Not easy on hard this game. Not easy. Let's try again. Without the failure this time, shall we? I do apologize for the resolution, chance. folks. Uh, there's nothing I can do about it. I've tried to set it up as a proper full screen. Although I guess Smoke on the recording, rises it's from coming Isengard. up as full screen. So the there you hour go. grows late, and now you strive to Isengard, seeking my counsel. But that is why you have come, is it not, my friend? End of the gay comes to Isengard, seeking my counsel. Oh my God, that video is terrible. It's so bad. That's to Lord of the Rings. That's not me. By the way, just before anybody falsely gets any bad ideas about me here. Fuck you. Things that go boom. An Isengard story. Get 
Shut him up, boys! Okay, Gandalf's a little bit overpowered. <laughs> He's got, like, better range damage than Legolas, better health than Gimli, and better I was sent back to assume your mantle to right your wrongs. It is you who spreads fear amongst the innocent. Oh man, Orcure would have come in perfect here. I'm pretty sure in this game, when you use the counter moves, it does give you instant perfect. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty damn sure. That's where I got the idea from for the few towers. Also, this game has checkpoints. Thank you, Saddam, God. the trees of Fangorn have awakened. Tendrils seek, branches crush, roots bury all that remains of your vanity. Burn them all, I say. And good riddance. We shall smash them all! Damn it, Ant! You're on my what side! What does it take to kill you? One does not simply kill Gandalf the White. We will not suffer your fires! Jesus. I mean, the Ants, honestly, they don't even really need help here. You've got down the leader! I think, uh, seeking to, seeking to stop them here at their spawn point, that's the way to get a good bunch of kills out of this, because otherwise they just run away. May the Valor protect you! You don't really get a lot of opportunities to get kills here, because they just kill them so efficiently themselves. This part actually kind of annoys me. Those trees are an ancient madness. They require burning before they destroy all who live near them. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Okay. Who dares? Who dares? We actually got some perfect kills. I can't believe it. There's Isengard. Saruman, the time of unmaking is at hand. Such anger, I pity. I like how there's this internal dialogue going on between Defend the two. It's quite cool. Yeah, well, maybe if you didn't put a big, gigantic box of explosives right next to your towers, things wouldn't go so bad for you. See, this is why evil never wins, because evil is dumb. To quote Spaceballs. Except in reverse. Fuck your towers! But seriously, though, I mean, things that go boom in Isengard's story. Let's make it happen, people. I need help. I also need a better camera angle. Out of my way. Ah. 
Dick stab. Gandalf, dick stabber. You could not have missed more. Like, seriously, that was so bad. Alright. These camera angles are seriously annoying. Solomon, Gandalf comes to Isengard. No longer seeking your counsel. Raum, ra. That's like the best war cry. Don't let anybody tell you differently. Nope. These camera angles, though. Oh, that's a berserker. Right away! I shall now help the Ents undo the final support. Handled that pretty well. Got into a bit, a little bit of trying hard mode here. Come on. we do a lot of good and fair kills oh really only a good but I got like that should at least be an excellent rating I would think ah well whatever I don't care it's fine so uh, let's see Ah, oh, you can use the arrows. That makes things easier. Alright, so we need, um... Oh, I did get this. Oh, god damn it! I had that the whole time? I completely forgot about that. That's such a fail on my part. Alright, well, I'll be making use of that next time. Don't you worry. Um... We will knock down, then finish off powerful enemies with this combo. Man, that's difficult. So, left click, left control, then Z. Interesting one. I changed my controls up a bit in case you're wondering if they're different from yours. Oh, that would be quite useful as well. Power Ox Gambit. Now you see, this is a bit better. Left click, left control, right mouse button. Left click, left control, right click. Alright, well... I'm gonna grab this. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go with these two for now. Because, I mean, what I'm gonna be aiming to do is basically just comboing people. Continue. Uh, 
Okay. Well, it's been 30 minutes. Should we do another one? I don't think so. Alright, well, the next episode, we will be doing the Paths of the Dead. And you'll have to wait to find out what character I'm going to play, but I think you all are going to be pleased with it. But, uh, yeah, so that concludes the first episode of The Return of the King. Let me know what you guys thought. Thank you for watching. Drop a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Uh, it really helps me sustain myself, grow my channel, check out my Patreon to help me directly. And as always, until the next video, stay awesome.